Hello everybody, welcome to the Hunter Call of the Wild. This is Medvatega. I might leave the weapons on that I have selected. But uh, we're going to do a couple missions, at least two or three. Maybe a side mission, that Bronze Age kill bear. So. So. We're going to go right over here. We're going to go right over there and visit the sacred place. Yeah, don't matter. If it's day, dark or night, we're going to still visit it. This is what she's saying here. Is that we gotta of course we got revenge of cranking so the ancestors prayer that's the mission she wants us to go to this site welcome to just started the stream, The Hunter Called the Wild, Medvatega, Part 8, Story Missions, Completing Story Missions. Do a few, I want to do a few story missions over here and build it. Thought I'd do a little dark time. Yeah. Uh, I hate that. It's ridiculous. Four-wheelers really don't react like that on snow not this low of snow they usually keep on trucking they don't slide like that very just not very realistic the only time I see ATV slide when it's really deep snow so there you are the Nenets migrate hundreds of kilometers across the Yamal Peninsula. Sites like this have served the community for a millennium. This one is my personal favorite. It is dedicated to my great-great-uncle, a shaman, who was said to have spiritual visions on this spot. Open your mind, Hunter. What visions will you have? How I wish I could be there with you. Not in a romantic way. We are close, but not that we'll just close. start right here below I mean, I Soul be Lake Taiga. To be in the wild, Go right up here. climbing. Oh, it's Vinny. I am being sentimental. Let me give you some peace in this beautiful place. Nice. So something lost. So that'll be the next mission. We may be able to even do it at night. The lost and the found, so that's a cool mission. I'll Sorry, see where I meant to give you a break, but I've got an urgent job for you. Locals here in the village are saying there is a radioactive mutant on the loose, which sounds about as credible as Georgis Chuchunya. But Katerina says something spooked her neighbors heard last night. And now some Nanet's reindeer have gone missing. Maybe another lynx. Maybe something else. Need to put an antler rattler on. Can you try to find a missing reindeer? I'm gonna make it in the morning too. Katerina is marked on your hunter mate. Head that way and scout for tracks. Cause in it you'll have to try to take out a uh reindeer so it didn't cost too much I don't think so we'll put an antler rattler with us if we get a chance we'll shoot a bear too so the lost and found mission the lost and found it's pretty simple 
Uh, you're going to go down here and look where you find a collectible right here, the mammoth tusk from this outpost right here. Pishbedoin Plateau Eastern Outpost. Just remember it's right below the big lake there where we just went to that Ninet's ancestral prayer. Right. So just start here and head down this way. What you got to do is find out because some of the, the reindeers come up missing. A reindeer or some reindeers come up missing. So what you, the idea of this travel to the marked spot on your map. And what it is, they're, they're, they're one thing you got to do is find a dead reindeer, find a dead bobcat, and you will track and kill a reindeer. You can just sneak up there and kill him, but it won't happen until you trigger a certain area. We'll do three missions here. Then we'll only have probably two missions. We'll have a Lynx one to do. And then we'll have a uh, another one to do. We'll have a... Uh, Hey, right there's your mammoth tusk. You see that? You see that right there? the pig there it is see it You want to go down here and grab these tracks. Alright. A solar reindeer. Follow that trail. And it's a one of Ninnat's reindeer too. Reindeer is dead. Got it. But not eaten. Lynx do not kill for sport. Maybe there was a lynx, but it was scared off before it could eat. By what? I don't know. See if there are tracks nearby. Aha! Lynx tracks fleeing this area. Just as I suspected. You see, there's a mammoth tusk. And then, uh,. Dead links too? That can only mean one thing. Do you see other tracks nearby? Bear tracks. This isn't a lynx problem. This is a bear problem. But what kind of bear would do this? Why wouldn't it eat the animals it kills? Can you take a picture of those tracks? This bear has an odd walk. Like it's... like it's... injured. Ugh, short. I may know this bear. There is something you and I should discuss. Do you hear 
hear that? It's a reindeer. Wounded. Maybe by this bear. Please, find this reindeer and spare it any pain. Be careful. The bear might be nearby. Eat down. <laughs> Took him out quick, didn't I? Indeed. Thank you. I'll let Katerina know we found the missing reindeer. Danger ahead. So if we see a bear up here, we'll definitely uh, put a couple rounds on him. Do I have a predator collar? Oh yeah. Wind ain't very good though, of course, is it? I should do it.
maybe I should have used the 7 mil. <laughs> I should have probably put the 7 mil on here instead of the 243. Unless that's him. Unless that's him. That I don't know. Might be him. Nah. So there's the tracks. That you're supposed to follow. There it is. Follow this trail. away from Mamantovaya Tundra and toward Pustaya Mountain. In English you would call it Hollowed Mountain. Okay. Pustaya Mountain is a place with bad memories for me. But you don't have time for that sob story now. The temperature has dropped over 10 degrees in the last few hours and we've got a storm front coming in. You need to get to safety before that happens. Look for a campsite in the area marked on your hunter mate. Get there before the weather turns against you. You can return to this bear hunt when the storm passes. Alright. So on Hollowed Mountain is the next mission. We'll go ahead and do that. Then we'll uh call it quits all right pretty easy mission I mean all you gotta do is uh, let's go in like a good place to wait it out the storm should blow over in about eight hours Take that time to rest. Okay, the storm is over, and we are back to the slightly more tolerable version of sub-zero weather. Hmm. Before you get back to your bear hunt, Georgi reported a lynx behaving very strangely nearby, wandering in the daytime, exposing its position. Unusual behavior for a strategic, nocturnal predator. Georgi is not the most reliable source for us, but something tells me this is no hoax. Maybe it's another lynx injured by that bear. Maybe it's another anthrax problem. Mark the area Georgi reported on the hunter mate. Have a look.
So I hope you enjoyed it all. Next time we come on, we'll start off with just hunting for the bear. And we'll just hunt around the area for, their, for a bear. So we'll probably go down in here, hunt around for a bear to kill. And then we'll do the lynx. So, I thank you for watching, everybody. Have a good one.